Okay, this is Steve James with Snowish Magazine. I'm with Christian Berger. He's a, a project leader for two-stroke engines for Rotex in Austria. Uh, Christian, is this your first time out west? Uh, it's the second time. Second time. How about mountain in uh, riding in the mountains? Like uh, it's a great experience. I uh, did not expect to get to these places uh, that soon, honestly. So okay, so you don't you don't have this kind of riding where, where no, you're used to. No, not at all. Not now, at Christian, all. you're the one that developed the uh, eight or was part of the development of the 850 yeah. Rotex that uh, is so popular right now. The E Tech. Tell us a little bit about what went into making that engine. Uh, the key on that engine is basically all about response. So this was the main trigger for the whole development and many features were following that, that key, let's say, uh, request. Okay. It's interesting because there's sort of a progression. You came out with the 850, then you came out with shot right, right after it, and then yeah. you came out with the turbo a couple of years later. Yeah. How was that all in the plans? Uh, the plan was set like this from the beginning on. So it was set up as a, as a family development. So we started, as you said, with the 850 AD. Uh, in the second step, we rolled out the 600R. So this was also part of the family and the RS uh, application of that. It had to be shot ready. And now the turbo application is just what we roll out next. And the 600 EFI is the actually last step of this family rollout. It was considered as a family from the beginning. Okay, what kind of satisfaction do you get when you've been working on an engine for years, yeah. then you get out here on the mountains and you're watching expert riders yeah. ride the product you developed, how it's supposed to be ridden. Yeah. What kind of satisfaction comes from that? Uh, it basically, it makes me so proud, I can tell you, to see th those machines in the natural environment, let's say, and also have the opportunity to try it by myself. So. It's, it's you're all, all day long in the office on the dyno fixing issue, making small steps, but uh, seeing the final result and the good reaction of the customers is what counts at the end. Now you're telling us uh, last night that it was about a five year development on that engine. Yeah. Uh, so you're working five years in advance. Yeah. So just between you and me, what are we going to see in 2026? Okay. It won't go anywhere, just between you and me. <laughs> I can't tell you. I don't know. Maybe ask for it. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Steve James with Christian. We're up here uh, just off Two Top uh, doing some product testing, photo shooting. Uh, a great day. Great day to be riding.